it's good youtube it's cuddle of death here hey happy day woo and as you can see i'm coming at you guys with this multi battle which was on a lumio station prison podcast episode in the past but uh it's between myself nappy versus pk sparks and num nexus now this battle is completely just for fun obviously but i did want to mess around a little bit with my del fox i figured hey they're not going to expect me to use a del fox because people kept talking trash on del fox so i was like time to bring in a del fox just to throw people off also sorry if you guys can hear my stomach growling i haven't really eaten all day so I'm going to eat right after this. Don't worry. Also, I wanted to explain my inactivity for those of you guys who do not follow me on Twitter and whatnot. So the majority of the video will be about that and not really focusing on commentating the battle as much. But I will mention a few more things about this battle. Nappy and I did get together and I did choose some of his Pokemon. I accidentally meant... I, I meant for him to take Dig Dug instead of his Rotom. But I did say Rotom at the last second, so I got scared right off the get-go because we did not have a rapid spinner. That's okay, though. So you guys can kind of watch how this video plays out itself. I'm going to go ahead and get onto why I haven't been uploading. But the last thing I do have to say about the battle is don't diss on the Del Fox. I did get the uh, set from Google just to try it out. I'm not like a super amazing competitive battler, so don't diss the Del Fox. Okay, so... Where have I been? Why am I so inactive? If you guys follow me on Twitter, most of the time you will more than likely know why I've been so inactive. Uh, one of the reasons is December is a really bad month for me. I usually get pretty down and whatnot, so I just, you know, like to spend time playing games. And lately a lot of stuff has been going downhill, but it's actually going back uphill. But because it has been going downhill, at least at the beginning, I have been less inactive, or less inactive, whoops, less active, there we go. My stomach will not stop growling. Um, another thing is the whole YouTube copyright claim thing that's been going around. I've been hit with several of those, and my friends have also been hit with tons of those. So for that, I also do have a Twitch.tv channel. I plan on doing a lot more streams next year in 2014. So if you guys are interested in watching and catching some of my live streams, I will leave the link to my Twitch channel in the description, but it is twitch.tv slash cuddle of death. Now with these copyright claims, there's not really much I can do about them. I don't plan on quitting YouTube. In fact, I actually plan on taking an entirely different direction for my channel. I will still do Pokemon stuff, don't worry, but I want to start doing a lot more random games on my channel. I didn't really intend for this just to be a Pokemon channel. So you're going to see random uploads along with Pokemon in the future. As far as projects that have yet to be completed, such as the Black 2, White 2 split screen, that's still coming. A lot of you guys have constantly asked about that, and I, and I know it's been a long time since I've uploaded that, but there's a lot of stuff that's been going on that's been keeping me from putting it together and uploading it. It will be finished. Same with Pokemon Volt White and Pokemon X. I plan on starting to record Pokemon X again very, very soon. It's just a lot of stuff has come up, including a lot of charities that I've been a part of. I've been a part of a fundraiser to help Frozen Train get his computer, which he got it and he's built it. So thank you guys that actually came out to that. And uh, now he can actually play stuff and record stuff. So I'm sure you guys will see videos of him and I and others in the future as well. Once again, so thank you guys. And then recently I just helped out with a Child's Play charity that ended yesterday on the 23rd. That was a three-day charity. I streamed Pokemon Fire Red for that, and it was amazing. I had tons of fun with it. And then there was stuff where a lot of my friends were kind of getting down and whatnot. So I wanted to be here for them, and it was stressing me out. So everything was just going everywhere. And uh, I was trying to help out with my friends, the charities, the fundraisers, and just trying to figure out when I was going to come back. I'm very happy that I had this battle so I could commentate over it since it's a very casual-like thing and just, you know, tell you guys what's going on. So, um, outside of that, like I said, I have the Twitch, twitch.tv slash cuddle of death, and I definitely do recommend that you guys follow me on there. Not only will it help me grow my Twitch channel, and maybe I can get partnered on there one day, but it'll also send you guys a nice little message to your email every time I am streaming, just in case you're not following me on Twitter, because I will be tweeting out every single time I do go live. But, um... Outside of that, I am really looking forward to next year. You're going to see most of my uploads start up again next year, just in, over the next few days, you know, because since Christmas is here and I celebrate it, I'm going to be busy with my family for the next few days as well. 
then there's New Year's and just all kinds of stuff coming up. But once the new year rolls around, I'm going to start being crazy lots more active. I plan on doing maybe like face cam stuff for you guys more often because I know you guys have really enjoyed that in the past. And uh, I don't know, I just want to be more interactive with you guys. I want to grow my audience again. I want to com communicate. I can't even talk. I want to communicate with Team Happy Day again. I do not know if I'm going to do a Team Happy Day Skype call like I did last year because of how busy these next few days are going to be. But if I do plan on doing one, I will probably be live streaming it either on here or on my Twitch. Probably on my Twitch. And if I do do that, it's going to be after Christmas. Obviously before January 1st since that would be the new year. But I would like to actually organize one of those again soon because the last one I had was amazing. I got to talk to just a handful of you guys. But even just talking to a, a handful of Team Happy Day has made my previous year, which went into this year, it started off so well because of that. There was a uh, guy that actually, you know, told me that he looks up to me and whatnot, and I just got very emotional about that, and it was just an amazing feeling. By the way, going back to the battle, the Del Fox is still on the field. <laughs> And this is what uh, Nexus and PK didn't do. They didn't go for the Del Fox, which was just being super annoying. And uh, Thickums was over there taking hits, taking names. So it all worked out in the end. I think I've pretty much gone over every single thing that's been going on, though. The best way to get your news from me if I'm not uploading is through Twitter. I do actually reply to tweets on there if they are asking me questions like, you know, what's going on and whatnot. But I will also say, you know, the obvious. I'm not, like, dead or anything. I'm here. I'm uploading. Everything's good. And the X and Y co-op is still going on. And fun fact, we did miss an X and Y episode one week. Yeah, not not this. Not the time I just posted this. We actually just had our episode that was supposed to go up the previous week go up a few days ago. The most recent Sunday. I'm recording this on December 24th. I'm kind of rambling. That's okay. But we did miss that because, like, Nappy's rendering program crashed on him. So it's like, it's it's very interesting to see how people react whenever an episode doesn't get uploaded. And this is why I can't stress enough to follow people on Twitter. Because whenever we can't get an episode up on something like Lumio Station, we do tweet that stuff out as well. And I know um, getting to be a part of social networking sites can be annoying. But I can promise you, if you have a lot of YouTubers that you watch, most of them do have Twitters. Anything that ever happens usually does go on Twitter. And we don't always have time to make an update video saying, Oh, X and Y didn't get uploaded because of this, or I'm not posting videos because of this. So I was very happy to finally get around to being able to make this video for you guys. As rambly as I am in this video, it's still a very nice thing to do. And that Gastrodon is looking so cute. But I left him on the field and I told Nappy to leave him alone because he wasn't really doing anything. So I was like, let's leave the Gastrodon there. So we did leave him there. And uh, we took out PK first. And finally near the end I was able to bring out this Charizard, which is Jay's Charizard. It doesn't have Roost on it, which is unfortunate. I had to bring it in on the rocks. But I was like, okay, whatever. It's going to be super fast now anyways. We can still use it to deal some damage at this point. Like I said, this was a very, like, randomly planned team. And it was very quickly planned just for the podcast. So it did turn out in our favor, though. Which was really nice because we were talking through Skype saying, Oh, man, we're definitely going to lose. Especially after not having Dig Dug. But actually, at the beginning, with the fact that Rotom will wisp the T-Tar, it did help us quite some, some... It did help us out quite a little bit. I am everywhere tonight. I am, I've still been stressing over the past few days because of the charity and everything that's been going on, so don't mind me if I'm just rambling and whatnot. But I figured I would at least give you guys something. As we do, go ahead and start taking out the last Pokemon on, I think it was Num Sparks. We are King Death versus Num Sparks. And uh, we took out this Gyarados now with a nice little uh, solar beam. There it goes. It was a really fun battle. I have gotten every single thing out that I wanted to say. If you want to follow me on Twitch, it is linked in the description. And uh, thank you guys so much for listening and watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed the battle. And I do plan on actually doing more battles in the future and actually commentating over them instead of giving you guys a random update 
I almost said a random update battle. A random update video with a battle. It was still a good battle regardless. Thank you guys for watching. I'm still here. And there will be a lot more to come in 2014. I love you guys. Bye!